sexy. My name New. Nice to meet you. You from LA? Yes. Okay, I just moved down here and shit. Man. Where are you from? Chicago. Nice. But they're the right one for you, and that's okay too. And he's been also dating. In the ever-enticing world of celebrity relationships, scandal and intrigue seem to be ever-present. The latest buzz surrounds none other than Kim Kardashian, the epitome of glamour and allure, as she finds herself caught in the middle of a sensational controversy. But this time, the twist is mind-boggling. It involves Kanye West's wife, no, not Kim herself, but the enigmatic Bianca Sensori. A TikTok video capturing Bianca's flirtatious encounter with another man has sent shockwaves through social media, leaving fans and onlookers in a state of disbelief. As whispers of infidelity and deception fill the air, all eyes turn to Kim Kardashian, Kanye's former spouse, for her response to this jaw-dropping revelation. This is the enthralling story of Kim Kardashian's response to Kanye's wife's flirtation, a tale that will leave you hanging on every word, eagerly awaiting the next chapter of this riveting celebrity saga. I definitely protected him, mm -hmm. and I still will. In my home, mm -hmm. my kids don't know anything that goes on mm. on the outside world. Over the weekend, an Instagram user recorded himself unknowingly flirting with Kanye West's rumored wife, Bianca Sensori. The video shows them having a friendly conversation in a department store with the man trying to strike up a connection. He even compliments Bianca's good eye contact, but things take an unexpected turn when he asks for her number. You won't believe what happens next. Bianca with a smile responds, I'm married and flashes a huge diamond ring. Fans are not too happy with Bianca's reaction. One of them commented, she is too friendly. Another added, that's flirting. She knew what his motive was and entertained it. Well, the video's caption reveals that Kanye West is indeed her husband. This shocking news has captured the attention of the entire world. Fans are left wondering, what was Kim's reaction to Kanye's new marriage? And on top of that, she is already flirting with another man. Well, according to recent reports, Kim Kardashian is not happy about Kanye's secret marriage. Sources close to Kim revealed that she can't stand Kanye's new wife and has had tensions with her in the past. Kim hates her. She's pretty, and Kim hates pretty girls, a source close to the Keeping Up with the Kardashian star told Page Six. The insider also claimed Kim had sensed there was a certain frisson between Kanye and Bianca prior to news of their secret nuptials. Apparently, Kim was jealous of Bianca's natural beauty, and there were instances where she believed Bianca was being overly flirty with Kanye. It's clear that there's no love lost between Kim and Bianca. However, Bianca Sensori, Kanye's new wife, is an Australian architectural designer who has been working at Yeezy for several years. According to her LinkedIn profile, Bianca joined Yeezy in November 2020, three months before Kim filed for divorce. Prior to working at Yeezy, she owned a jewelry line and worked as a design consultant and student architect. Not much else is known about Bianca's personal life or her connection to Kanye prior to their marriage. As for the secret wedding itself, TMZ has reported that Kanye and Bianca had some form of a private wedding ceremony. Although they haven't filed a marriage certificate yet, photos published by TMZ show Kanye wearing a wedding band on his ring finger. Witnesses have confirmed that the couple celebrated their honeymoon in a luxurious resort located in Utah's Grand Circle of National Parks and Monuments. On the other hand, Kim Kardashian and Kanye West were married for six years and together for well over a decade. The two have four children together, North, St. Chicago, and Psalm. Although their very public relationship had many ups and downs, the two always seemed to overcome their problems and come back stronger. Kim helped Kanye with his mental health struggles, and Kanye seemed to be as in love with Kim as the first day. But this fairy tale in public was far from perfect in reality. The two fell apart completely in 2021, had had enough of the constant stress and struggles. She wanted to end things amicably and smoothly once she realized the marriage was over for her. Kim tried her best in her marriage, but when she realized that it was only making her life miserable, there was no going back. She talked about it saying, it was not like, one specific thing that happened on either part, she explained. I think it was just a general difference of opinions on a few things that led to this decision, and in no way would I want someone to think I didn't give it my all or I didn't try. But Kanye wasn't one to back off so easily. He was still very much in love with Kim even after the divorce and wanted to win her back. He talked again and again about how despite their differences and their problems, he believed that they belonged together. 
we're not even divorced, he claimed during an appearance on Revolt's Drink Champs podcast. So how we, because it's no joke to me, my kids want their parents to stay together. I want their parents. I want us to be together. From sending her messages through his performances to writing pleas on Instagram, Kanye did everything to win Kim back. But that chapter was closed forever, and Kanye had to finally accept the truth and move on as they finally reached a settlement in November 2022, focusing on co-parenting their four children. However, during the divorce proceedings, both Kim and Kanye were rumored to be dating other people. Kanye was seen with several women, some of whom bore a striking resemblance to Kim herself. Meanwhile, Kim dated comedian Pete Davidson, which seemed to bother Kanye. He made public comments and social media posts expressing his disapproval of Kim's new relationship. And now, fast forward to January 2023. While Kim was attending a funeral, Kanye surprised everyone by marrying Bianca Sensori. Fans are standing up in support of Kim after the latest change in the family dynamic. It's natural that Kim isn't immediately at ease with a new woman coming into her ex-husband's life, but recent reports suggest that Kim had always been suspicious of Bianca's intentions and disliked her presence. Her hatred for Bianca even became known around the Yeezy HQ. Well, Kim's response was cryptic but telling. On her Instagram, she posted a quote that said, I'm in my quiet girl era. I don't have much to say, just much to do. This was followed by posts hinting at perseverance and surrounding oneself with supportive people. While Kim didn't explicitly address the situation, it's clear she has a lot on her plate and is focusing on her own journey. Many wonder if Kim's reaction implies that she is not happy about Kanye moving on so quickly. It's understandable considering the history and emotions involved in their relationship. However, Kim has also mentioned in interviews that she's not looking to date anyone at the moment and is focused on raising her children and creating a stable environment for them. Despite Kim Kardashian and Kanye West's differences with each other, Kim wants to shield the children against any negative news about their father. If they don't know things that are being said, why would I ever bring that energy to them? That is real heavy grown-ups that they are not ready to deal with. When they are, we will have those conversations. One day, my kids will thank me for not sitting here and bashing their dad. I could. Kim worked hard to make sure the kids continue to feel loved and protected by their father and that their marital problems don't impact the kids' relationship with Kanye. I definitely protected him, and I still will in the eyes of my kids, for my kids. So in my home, my kids don't know anything that goes on in the outside world. Of course, this wasn't always easy for Kim to put a smile on her face and pretend like nothing is wrong, but she continued to do it for the sake of the children. She recalls, if we are riding to school and they want to listen to their dad's music, no matter what we are going through, I have to have that smile on my face and blast his music and sing along with my kids. I can act like nothing's wrong, and as soon as I drop them off, I can have a good cry. Initially, there were reports that Kim was doing everything in her power to keep Bianca out of the kid's life. Still, the two had to do some work to come to the same plane now that Bianca was also involved in the co-parenting. A source close to the two confirmed this, saying Kim and Kanye's relationship is okay, even though the pair are still having some back and forth with a few arguments. Now the big question is, what does the future hold for Kim Kardashian and Kanye West? Will they be able to co-parent amicably? For now, Kim's priority is undoubtedly her children's well-being, and she wants to ensure they grow up in a safe and stable environment. And she really didn't care if her new wife would cheat on him or not. To which one of the fans commented, she is not sexually attracted to Kanye West, she is just using him. As for Kanye, his actions continue to raise eyebrows, leaving fans and the media intrigued about his next move. That's it for today, folks. Until next time, goodbye.